this video, we're going to learn how to make really good use of all the tools in our ovens, our com convection steam oven and our convection oven. Now, cooking is all about planning. So let me explain to you what I'm doing here. Chicken drumettes or chicken pieces are very popular nowadays. And um, I found that a great way to cook them and keep the uh, meat really, really moist is to cook them at very low temperatures in the combi steam oven. Now my combi steam oven has a mode called low temperature cooking and it goes from 140 degrees to the max 200. So I use 200 degrees for these chicken pieces which I gave a little bit of seasoning to. So they're quite meaty. You can see that they're um, well, you can see they're cooked, but they're not showing um, any browning or any glaze. So, what's the next step? Well, we're actually going to get, put a little oil on here, and then we're going to finish them on high heat in the broil mode in the convection oven. Now, I much prefer doing my high heat cooking in my convection oven because the self-cleaning process is uh, much more effective when it comes to high heat cooking and the broiler is really powerful. I still use the broiler in my combi steam oven, but for more moderate types of browning and broiling. Now, because I had the oven at low temperatures, 200 degrees to cook the chicken pieces first, I can now go straight into the steam mode at 212 degrees. So I'm going to reset the oven to 100% humidity, 212. And I'm going to quickly steam these asparagus and sugar snap peas for a salad to go, ahead, go with the um, chicken. This salad with noodles and um, some carrots and cilantro, scallions and uh, red, red cabbage, I prepared in advance. There was nothing I could cook in any of the ovens. <laughs> but that happens sometimes, I have to be normal. So let's get this oven going for broiling. Now, my oven has two broil modes. It has a convection broil mode and a regular broil mode. I'm going to use the regular broil mode here because I want that drier heat for the browning and the crisping of these chicken pieces. I'm not going to toss them in, a, um, in the glaze yet because you know what happens anytime you have a glaze with sugar and you expose it to high heat, everything starts to smoke and the pan gets disgusting. So I'm going to get the chicken cooked. When it comes out, I'm going to take my glaze and I'm going to toss the chicken in the glaze. So the important things to think about with this particular meal coming together is that you cook the chicken low and slow. The combi steam oven is at a nice low moderate temperature so you can go straight into steaming for your green vegetables. And then you use broil in your convection oven for a very short period of time to get the browning, the crisping, and finally, you'll toss the chicken pieces in the glaze. I um, used a peanut dressing uh, for the noodle salad, and I made a little light um, rice vinegar dressing for the vegetables. I'm gonna to toss them with a little bit of mint and some um, uh, sliced radish. You could always add in a little bit of Thai sweet chili sauce if you like. A lot of nice flavors, it's a fun meal, easy to do. Remember one really important feature, never broil with the door open and the broiler only requires a five minute preheat time. Okay, so here we go. Let's get these broiling. Mm -hmm. 